Hey, good morning, everybody. I'm Cesar Ruest from Autodesk, based here in Toronto. Um, we never saw each other's presentation, and it was interesting to see your presentation from the get-go. And I like the mishmash of arrows back and forth. And that's exactly what the communication issue is that we're trying to solve. Um, these different vendors, myself from Autodesk, these are disconnected. No matter what kind of authoring tool that you're using, we see the silos that are made from the data that you create and the challenges that are faced on delivering those pieces of data out to individuals and members across your design team, across your construction team, and then eventually to the owners. And that causes friction, causes delays, version control. So the same pieces of challenges um, from our first presenter is exactly the same thing that we see within Autodesk as, as well. Now, the strategy that we try to put forward for you guys is to remove the idea of investing more in IT, investing more within expensive hardware, and taking that from you and putting that into the cloud so you can actually invest now on the mechanisms in which you're going to access the project data. You're going to enhance the communication, and you're going to connect the entire team. Uh, my bullet points underneath this slide really are in blue. Uh, we're talking about 360 services from Autodesk. So anytime you see 360, it really means a cloud strategy for you to uh, invest with your teams to put the project data in a cloud site. And the value proposition there is that you have anywhere, anytime access to that data. It's portable. Or I should say, not portable, accessible. So like this slide's telling us, think accessible, not portable the internet enabling, not the stuff that's on the left-hand side in the bottom of the screen, the perception saying my, da my data's loose in the cloud and it's the wild west and I'm gonna be hacked and all that stuff, that's not the case. We're talking about web services from Amazon hosted through Autodesk Services and 360 that's giving you cell phone, tablet, web browser capabilities. So you're really using web browser, your project team is updating their data, very much in a very social environment, but based on the project itself. Maybe uh, you're like me, you're at a coffee shop, you get that notification from Jake and he says he's just updated something and I'm gonna have my phone or my iPad with me and view that model specifically while I'm sitting with my browser. And that's the nice thing around a, uh, a tool like this where you're not inundated with how to install software launch the browser, view the model, view the drawings, view the document. This is what cloud sharing is capability of, of, of within the A360 product services. So mobile meaning Android, iPhone, iOS, uh, regular desktop PCs, Mac browser. It's not, um, it's not a specific app uh, that you actually drive. The notifications uh, that you get when people update their files push to your phone. Um, that's all about one of the product services that we call A360 Team, a social project delivery mechanism. So A360 Team can be coupled with this powerhouse, which is collaboration for Revit. So for those of you who literally use Revit, collaboration for Revit is Revit server in the cloud. You're reaching out to the cloud, you're hosting your central file, so that literally everybody on the team outside of your firewall can access the single central file repository. Accessing that file repository is allowing people to save back to central, allowing other people very quickly to see the changes that you have made to that model. So this is a Revit application. Uh, one of the code names for it was Skyscraper. That is built right into Revit now uh, when you, when you install that service, and included with it is a browser communicator right within the Revit environment itself called Communicator. So when somebody makes a change, you can communicate through text, and you can communicate through visual screenshots to notify the next person inside of your team, no matter where they are in the world, that you have just made updates and changes to your models. So I'll be at the next session for the mobile piece, which is actually talking about carrying mobile data with you and I hope to see you at that session. Thanks everybody.